Welcome to the first Mateo Monday. All Nico. right. I'm Cleveland. And I'm Mateo. I'm son. I'm dad. And I'm big brother. So from now on, every Monday, you're going to have Mateo giving his views on a particular issue or issues starting today. Mm -hmm. So today, we feature Mateo Monday. Yes. And today, I will be talking about uh, my views on the licensed curfew and coronavirus measures, mm -hmm. right? So I believe that it is, well, in my opinion, mm -hmm. I think it is still too soon to um, lift the curfew from 24 hours to the 8 p.m. to 5 a.m. Okay. Because um, we still have more cases, although it has been lightening up. Like the one of the most recent cases, they the person had no travel history mm -hmm. and they had no known contacts. Mm -hmm. So since they were not sure about where they, this person may have contracted the coronavirus from, it could have been anything. It could be community spread. Mm -hmm. So um, lightening these measures, encouraging people to go back out now um, to be in places together. Um, I don't think that would be very good. Okay. Mm -hmm. So even in spite of the social distancing measures and the hygiene measures and so on? Right, because um, you can tell people to social distance, and most of them will, but some of them may not always. And mm -hmm. I, people can still touch stuff. And remember, if you get your bodily fluids, I, I mean, some spit or saliva or anything onto something and someone else touches mm -hmm. that and then rubs their face they could get it so i, I think it's the safest move to still stay home okay mm -hmm. so you are advising people to still stay home and not to do all of this um e yes or to do it in you know um not not too much not to go out too much not to um <laughs> Take by myself, she agrees with you, Matthew. Okay. At least you have one support there. Not to take an inch for him. <laughs> All right, so that is Matteo on Monday. Mm -hmm. That's the first issue of Matteo Monday. Thank you very much, sir. Yes, yes. <laughs> Mikael, what's going on in your neck of the woods? So today, my teacher, Mr. Stefan Walker, has a birthday today. Happy birthday! Happy birthday. <laughs> And then there's also another boy in my class named Leon. Yeah. Okay. Named Leandre Heather Clark. Right. Who um has a birthday today as well. Happy birthday, Leandre. Happy birthday. Right. But today was also the first day that you went back to school, so to speak, online. Yes. Tell us about that. Um, it was all right, but didn't really do that much work mm -hmm. because we sort of celebrated his birthday. All right. It was a celebration of Mr. Walker's birthday and Leandre and so on. Mm. All right. So one of the issues Matteo touched on was the whole issue of the lightning of the curfew restrictions. And I saw a video and some photographs of people going to the beach today because part of the restriction is that you can now go to the beach between 6 and 9 a.m. to exercise and swim. And when I saw those photographs, I was really amazed and shocked that there were so many people on the beach. Someone pointed out that some of the people were wearing masks and so on. But um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. I would not be going to the beach between 6 and 8, 9 a.m. quite yet. Even though I love the beach and I was look for, looking forward to the whole um, thing of getting back into the running and the exercising outdoors or outside of the house, but not quite yet. As Matteo said, I'm gonna um, play on the precautionary side, on the cautionary side, and stay home for now and don't do the six to nine beach thing because there are just too many people out there. All right, uh, can you hear the ice cream? <laughs> can you hear the ice cream van like it passes through? like twice a day, every single day. Is it people eating more ice cream during Corona? I don't know. I think so. I think people are because consuming. they have more time to themselves. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they're probably bored. Yeah. They um, have nothing to do. <laughs> you have schoolwork. Mateo has schoolwork. I have work. 
And reportedly, Shabbat is supposed to be oh, coming in soon. <laughs> and for delivery. And, so. and KFC has already opened. Oh, are you guys being paid for these ads? No. no I hope so. Sure, but we wouldn't mind a sponsorship. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. But, um, yeah, so people would be very happy about that. I know, I know. Like, yeah, okay. Well, we hope that we get paid for those ads sometime in the future. <laughs> so, thank you for joining us for the first Mateo on Monday, or Mateo Mondays. And um, the rest of the week, you'll be seeing Mikel and I talking about other things. Until tomorrow. I'm Mikel. I'm Cleveland. I'm Mateo. I'm Sean. I'm Dad. And I'm Big Brother. Bye. Bye.